So I'm gonna show you guys how I build a fire here in the North Woods. So this is our fireplace. And this is called a fireplace extraordinaire, which means you do sort of the opposite. When it gets really hot, you use this thing to close the flue. This is open, which means it opens up the chimney. But when it gets really hot, you close this. And down here are these fans that blow heat into the room. It also helps the wood not burn as fast. So I'm gonna show you guys how I build a fire. So the first thing I do is open the doors. Yesterday I swept out all the ash because you wanna have as much like air going around the wood as possible. And then you pull out this to open the flue so that smoke doesn't come into the room. And then over here I have wood that we've cut. So obviously you put it in the fireplace. And I use some like really lighter pieces and then some logs because the lighter ones will catch fire faster and get hot and then get the, the more dense logs going. So I do this and then I put that one on top there like that. So then in here we have some lighters are called fat wood. They're treated so that they help the fire go. And then we've got these Duraflame fire start things and then a fire blanket in case of a fire. So we take out one of these. So this is like a brick and it's got some stuff like soaked into it. It's kind of soft. And then you start this on fire and it burns so it starts your, your logs on fire. So it looks like this. So then I go ahead and I kind of put this I don't know. I just kind of put it somewhere where I know it's going to burn and wood's going to catch it. So then I recently got myself this torch to start fires because doing that little clicky big one is too much of a pain. So you push this in and turn it to the left and then click it. I'll show you guys. I can't do it with one hand though, so hold on. I've got it turned counterclockwise. I got this on Amazon. It starts this flame. So then I just Get this brick going and that goes pretty good that works way better than me trying to hold and keep clicking that big lighter let me do this side a little bit it's my first time using this so pretty impressed with it so far guys I'm gonna also creme brulee some stuff with this. So then I let that brick kind of get going. Then I add a couple of these fat woods, which I need to get more of. I kind of just put those in there. And then I'm gonna add another, like, more smaller piece of wood. Like this guy is a good one to put in there because he'll catch on fire right away. And then hopefully those logs will get going. So I leave the doors open until this really gets going. So, cause the more air, the more fire. So this usually takes about 10 minutes and then uh, I'll show you what happens after that. So I'll link this in the comments, but I got this on Amazon and then they also send you this butane fuel and then you just take the cap off of this and you need to refill and there's that little, oops, that little plug and then you put it in that little hole in the bottom and press it and it fills it up. I'm gonna probably stick one more fat wood here on top to kind of get this going. In just a couple minutes, it should really get going. So you can see it's really starting to get going. Hopefully that like kindling will start up pretty soon and then those more dense logs catch fire and when those little ones burn down I'll add a bigger one and then it will kind of just go all day and that uh, 
fan goes on, I close the flue, shut the doors, and it heats the whole house from top to bottom. It actually gets too hot in here. This way we don't have to use our furnace as much and we save on um, propane, which is very expensive right now. So you can see that those baby logs are getting nice and fiery and the bigger logs on the bottom are catching on. So I'm gonna give this about five more minutes and then I'm gonna shut these doors and then give that about 10 minutes and then close the flue. I'm actually gonna add this little guy on top here too. Sorry for the camera work. But there it goes. Out here, it's been snowing all day so far, but it looks like it's slowing down for now. So I'll get this going and then I'm gonna go outside and snow blow. I might be making this all up, but when the flames are blue, I feel like that's when they're extra hot. So that tells me it's okay for me to shut the doors. Like that. A minute, a couple minutes, I'll close the flue. Okay, this thing's going really good. So I'm gonna come here and push that in. If you can hear that that fan is on. And now this is heating our house. 